Parents often focus on how a particular form of ed education will make their children materially successful. This is a common discussion I have with moms and dads. One of the points I like to bring out in those discussions is, St. Teresa's is an approach that isn't focused so much on the material, but on the ethical, the moral, how to develop the virtue in a student. The curriculum at St. Teresa Catholic School was designed the way you'd build a Formula One racer. We are not beholden to any textbook publisher's conception of what, what it is to be an educated person. We're not beholden to a government definition of what it means to be an educated person. What we did instead is took several high-performing academic elements and put them in together into one very tight instructional package. Every student at St. Teresa Catholic School has music several times a week. The study of music expands our students' minds and it helps them to understand that the entire series that they learn in musical notation is preparing them for linguistic study. Notes, rests, flats, sharps already prepares the student to understand that there are certain combinations that work well for expression and others that do not. Athletics are an essential component of a St. Teresa Catholic School education. Our basketball, our track, our volleyball students have done really well in the last couple of years. But I say often to our student athletes, we're aiming uh, much higher than just winning a game. We want to win at serving others. We study Latin because it's the mother tongue of the Western intellectual tradition. We start our students off with songs and conversational Latin to ease them into the language. But by the time they're in seventh and eighth grade, they can read Julius Caesar and Cicero in their native tongue. That's how firm our commitment is to classical studies. I think we are going to come to be known as a model in the region, across the state, uh, as authentic Catholic classical education.